Next, I've got my trusty air... What's up, GQ? I'm Camila Cabello, and these are my essentials. You have no idea who I'm looking at right now. So, my first item will be, well, it's kind of two items, but I think of it as one. So I always have a book that I'm reading. Right now I'm reading Braiding Sweetgrass, and I'm right here, and it's a book about indigenous wisdom, scientific knowledge, and the teachings of plants by Robin Wall Kimmer. And it's already, like, I think, probably my favorite book I've ever read. It makes me feel really grounded. And I also always have a book that I haven't started because if I'm on the plane, or if I'm somewhere, usually I'll have another book if I'm closer to the end, but if I finish, I want to have another book already ready for me wherever I am. I've tried Kindles and I've, I've tried reading on my iPad as well. I guess if it was a conscious like sustainability, like environmental thing, I would move to a Kindle or an iPad, but I'm kind of old school in that. I love the feeling of a book. No technology, just me and like the words that somebody wrote. <laughs> This is kind of like my singing goodies. I've got um, this Manuka honey, which is so delicious. It's actually like dessert. I'm gonna have it right now. Mmm. It's so good. Just honey. Throw coat. Singer's necessities. Grether's pastilles. Also, singer necessities. And this is a brand new box of Entertainer Secret Spray. And this I will use if I like, the other day I did James Corden uh, Crosswalk, the musical, and I just had absolutely no voice. And that is like the most stressful situation ever for a singer when you have to sing and you're like, it's not coming out. And this is kind of like a little miracle. I don't use it all the time, but dry throat and hoarse voice and it just will kind of throat, what? Coat, throat coat. So that's my little singer's pouch, which I don't have with me all the time because I don't sing every day. And thank God, because I lose my voice a lot. I really like this water because it's waterific. This is like a super sustainable company and uh, it's not plastic. I'm slowly kind of looking at my life and being like, how can I make choices that are more environmentally conscious and sustainable, especially with the climate crisis and things that we're experiencing nowadays. So if I can have like two of these in a day, then that's really good. I would just never drink water. I don't know how I like survived, honestly. I call this little lady, actually, I don't know if she's a lady. I think she's non-binary, gender neutral. Sometimes I call her Miss Patty. Sometimes I call her Patty. People think it's funny, the relationship I have with my iPad. I got it during the pandemic because I had this obsession with reading uh, articles and I love reading the New York Times and the New Yorker and, and I don't have any social media on my iPad. It's purely recreational. Sketching stuff, even though I'm not good at it, or YouTube, I use it for studio sessions a lot and I collect stickers and I put it on Patty and whenever I lose Patty, my friends make fun of me because I'll always be like, Patty, where are you? So I have a very close relationship with my iPad. It's brought me a lot of joy and a lot of knowledge. Next, I've got my trusty air... I don't lose sunglasses, but I lose freaking AirPods. This is a really bad habit of mine. I think it's because, especially on planes, like I will take them off and then I'll fall asleep and then they'll fall through the cracks of the seats and then I can't find them. And Sean always gets mad at me because I always steal his AirPods and I'll rename them, like Camila's AirPods. <laughs> then I'll be like, these aren't your AirPods, they say Camila's AirPods. And he's like, that's because you renamed them. And I'm like, touche. So this one is it's my AirPods, but I have lost one. What am I listening to right now? I'm very late to things, so sometimes something will be popping and I will discover how good it is like two years later. And I just listened to Doja Cat's uh, Her album, which I'm a huge fan of. And I listen to a lot of, a lot of uh, Latin music, a lot of Setangana, a lot of uh, Bad Bunny right now, a lot of reggaeton. Sometimes I go in just like these moments of uh, just like being in a cave when it comes to pop culture and I don't know what's going on and then I'll emerge and I'll be like, guys, Doja Cat is amazing. And they're like, yeah, we know. I also want to show you these because they're they're dirty and clearly I walk around barefoot a lot because they're, they're kind of like you can see like 
my feet, my, my feet dirt. Especially when I'm working, try to bring some flip flops with me because I am a chancletera, which is kind of very Latin for like a flip flopper, which uh, means that I'm from Miami and I just am in flip flops there like 100% of the time. Gotta have some flip flops, especially if you're like, going to a party or a dinner and you're like, okay, now I'm ready to take these heels off. It's just, there's no shame in just whipping one of these out. My next item, I've got some sunglasses. I like to uh, have a pair of sunglasses with me, especially here in LA, like in Miami, I maybe wouldn't, but here there's like, paparazzi and like stuff. And also sometimes it's just too damn bright out there. I always bring some sunglasses to match whatever outfit I'm wearing. This doesn't really match, but it is what it is. This is Priv Privé Reveaux, which I think Haley Steinfeld worked with this uh, brand of sunglasses and, and I think they, they sent these to me. And I like that they're just like full coverage. If I'm hungry, like I don't wanna just like reach for like some chips, I'd rather reach for something healthy like a trail mix. This one is like one of my favorites. It's from Air One and it's got like cashews, it's got uh, goji berries, it's got dark chocolate and it's got walnuts. So it's very strong, 10 out of 10. And also this hue uh, dark chocolate, it's just so good. Dark chocolate also has a bit of caffeine doing promo or whatever and I'm like, I don't wanna have coffee but I need some caffeine. I'll just be like, give me the chocolate now lip gloss. Oh my God, it smells so good. And I uh, usually have like a lip gloss or lipstick or whatever matches with whatever I'm wearing that day. So today, it's this. I always have a charger with me because I can't tell you how many times I've been somewhere and my phone dies and I have to go into a store and be like, do you guys have a charger? Can I please charge my phone? If this was before I could drive too. Like I needed an Uber. So I'd be like, I'm literally stranded without my phone. Like this is not good. Mofir portable chargers see that I lose all the time. I don't know. It's just easier for me to just bring a cord and like a little, uh, it's a box. Charging cube. Wow. See, charging cube. I don't know. That was what it was called. Um, so I bring that and I'll just plug it wherever I am. Guys, thank you so much for checking out my essentials. Um, I'll see you next time.